Hey guys, welcome to Device Setup. In this quick guide, I'll show you how to enable WPS on your router in under one minute. Let's go. First, WPS stands for Wi-Fi Protected Setup and it helps you connect devices to your Wi-Fi without typing the password with just one tap or button press. To enable it, open your browser and type your router's IP address. It usually is 192.168.0.1 or 192.168.1.1. If you don't know your router's IP address, then watch video on our channel to learn how to find your router's IP address. Nevertheless, log in with your admin username and password. You will find them on the back of your router. Once logged in, go to the wireless settings. Then go to the WPS settings or sometimes you need to go to the advanced settings and then go to the Wi-Fi settings and there you will find the WPS settings option. In the WPS setting, you will see an option that says enable WPS. So just turn it on. Different routers have different interface, but you will find the enable WPS option in wireless settings or Wi-Fi settings. Once enabled, you can press the WPS button shown on your web interface or you can press the physical WPS button on your router. Next, on your phone, printer, Wi-Fi extender or any other device that supports the WPS button, you need to either press the WPS button or tap on connect via WPS in their interface and they will pair automatically, no passwords needed. And that's it, WPS is now active and your devices will get connected to each other within next 60 seconds. A quick tip, once setup is done, you can disable WPS again for extra security. And if this video helped, hit like and subscribe and check out my video on Wi-Fi extender setup in just two minutes, link in the description. Thank you so much, have a blessed day.